Hello and welcome. This is Nate with Nate's Manufactured Home Tours. Today we are at Intermountain Homes in Kalispell, Montana. Taking a look at this beautiful home called the Montana. It is a modern looking single wide. I believe this is about 76 feet long and 15 feet wide. I don't remember the exact uh, square footage of the home but as you can see we've got lots of transom windows let in lots of natural sunlight in the summer or in the winter for that matter as you can see once we get in because that's how we are in the middle of winter right now it's got the uh, hardy board siding on the outside gives you a long durable siding so you won't have to worry about any leaks or anything like that down the road couple more windows that's going to be above your your uh, shower and your master bath there once again sorry about the shaky camera uh, I do promise that here shortly you'll be seeing videos with uh, some better equipment So as we step inside, first thing you'll notice is uh, you've got a, your living room for, as soon as you walk in. This living room is pretty good size and there's those transom windows with all the windows on that back side there. As you can see I don't have any lights on in the home and it is cloudy day out and it's still pretty bright in here. Step on around here, see if I can get you a little bit better view of this living room. Once again, I do apologize that I don't have a wide angle camera yet. That is coming here shortly. Get you another view of these front windows with the transom window. As we head on into the kitchen here, you can see there's a room for a small dining room table. You've got some nice counters over here, cabinets above it. Got a little storage space above there, or shelf, whatever you want to put there. I guess probably a good thing would be some plants. Good sized cupboards. The shelves don't appear to be adjustable, but I'm sure you might be able to option that in if you needed adjustable shelves. You got your couple of cubbies here and then as you can see on the countertops here there are some nice looking countertops you got the glass backsplash helps add to that modern look 
Now we come on around over here. We'll take a look at your kitchen sink and some of the cupboards here. You do got the dual sinks. I kind of prefer the uh, farmhouse large sink. Got a bunch of transom windows here above your kitchen area. So you got lots of light coming into your kitchen. Sorry the camera didn't adjust very well to the lighting. It does come with brand new Whirlpool appliances. Right, taking a look at the kitchen from the, down here by the master bedroom, you can see you've got some really big cupboards here. Nice and tall. So you've got more than enough storage for this being a single wide. And coming on over here, we do have, of all things, a pantry, which you don't see very often in a single wide. So that'll give you some nice storage for all your dry goods. Just off to your left here is your laundry room. So this is a single white, so it's not going to be the biggest of laundry rooms, but you still got a couple of cabinets in here. And there's that that uh, hanging rod, so things that you don't like to put in the dryer, you can still let hang dry. Got your water shut off above your water heater there, your back door. As we come out of the laundry room, come on down here. First thing you'll see off to your left down here, this hall is going to be your bathroom here. So this is a guest bathroom. It does have the shower tub combo. This tub is kind of oval shaped to give you that uh, extra space in the tub. It looks like they've got the curved shower rack above it to match that tub. So now you've got the optimal st optimal space in your tub. Sorry, stumbling over my words here a little bit. And, you know, not too big a bathroom, but you know it is a single wide, and it is a good sized bathroom for being a single wide. You got that same countertop and backsplash as you had in the kitchen. Nice little accent there. Got some deep cupboards here in your bathroom, so you got plenty of storage space for your towels and your sheets and any other linens you might decide you want to store in here. Right, coming out of the bathroom, we'll go right on into this uh, end bedroom here. Got a couple of windows in here. You've got that transom window up there. Once again, I apologize I did not get the floor plans in time to be able to put up the uh, bedroom sizes in here um, hopefully by the time I do edit the get done editing this video I'll have the floor plan to be able to throw in at its normal spot you do got room for a good sized bed got a decent sized closet in here if I'm if I'm right in what I think it's gonna be This closet does appear to run the full width of the room, so that's pretty good. Coming on down here, we'll take a look at the master bedroom. 
Once again, I wish I had the sizes for you because this master bedroom is pretty darn good size for being a single wide. These high ceilings does help add to the overall look of the room and making it feel a lot bigger than what it even is. And there again, you can see you've got plenty of transom windows in this home. More than enough to give you a lot of natural light, so you won't have to turn a whole lot of lights on come winter time. And so here, standing back in the corner, you can see this room is pretty darn good size. That is a queen size bed, so you've got plenty of room to add a king size bed in here if you wanted to. Plenty of room for your dresser, storage bins as they've got there. Coming into your master bath here. You've got uh, dual sinks, which is something you don't see very often in a single wide. They're continuing on with the same countertops and the same glass backsplash couple of vanity mirrors there and you've even got uh, what appears to be a medicine cabinet already built in here and come take a look I think this opens up yeah we got a medicine cabinet built in that way you don't have to clutter your countertops with all your medicines or vitamins or whatever else you decide you might want to be putting in there you got a couple of good sized cabinets in here. Alright, as we come around here, you can see you've got your little, little bit of privacy with your toilet there. And once again, you can take a good look there. All these homes seem to have the bull nose corners, which gives you that added durability. Gives you more of a high end look also. And you can see they continued on with that uh, glass and tile uh, inlay there really gives you a nice accent on your on your tile shower there this is what I prefer is the tile shower over the shower tub combo in the master bath just kind of gives you that higher end feel gives you that better look and you've got your dual shower head so technically two of you could be taking a shower at the same time coming over here you've got your closet once again, this home is called the Montana. And they've got a nice big sign for Montana with a transom window above there. Gotta love Montana. Everybody's proud to live here. Alright, as we head on out here, we'll go ahead and wrap this thing up. Let me know in the comments what you think of this home. I think it's a pretty nice home. It's plenty of spacious for a single wide. Nice layout. Once again, this is Nate with Nate's Manufactured Home Tours. I'd like to thank you for watching this video, clicking on it. If you liked it, feel free to smash that like button down there, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. That way you know when we upload videos. I'm currently uploading every Sunday and Wednesday night at 6.30, so twice a week. And thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.